My name is Dr. Martin Fletcher and I'm a clinical psychologist. I treat uh, anxiety and depression in my private clinic and I've been treating people for about 20 years. Through my clinical training, um, I am well versed in cognitive behavioral therapies and uh, the, the um, state of the art modalities. What, what I like to do is I like to integrate spiritual practices and faith-based um, content to my um, believer uh, clients, what I found is that the uh, Gospels, uh, that's a wisdom literature and people are hungry for wisdom and there is, a, 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 I can very easily integrate the two and I find that that's very effective. The largest common thread that triggers anxiety in people is they just do not feel safe. They feel that the world is threatening and not kind to them. They feel like they are under a almost constant uh, attack or that there's a danger out there. And what people really want, I find almost universally, when we get down to it, is they want to feel peace. They want calm. I've had patients before where we, when we finally hit that, I said, what do you want, what do you want? And we dance around happiness and other things like that. But when we get down to it, I've had patients when we say, you, you want to feel safe? Boom, they just start crying. That is what people really long for, to feel like they belong in this world and that it's going to be okay. Anxiety disorders are the most common mental disorders in America, about 40 million people or 17%. That means one out of every five people you're gonna see is gonna have an actual disorder. Other people have anxiety, but these are actual full-blown disorders, which means this causes people unnecessary suffering and or interferes with their daily functioning. What I want you to know is this, there's a way out. I see it all the time. There is a way out and uh, we want to make that available to you. People get well all the time from anxiety um, and um, what, we, what I want to do along with Ron Dunn, uh, my partner, is um, lead you through that in, in this course. I want you to know that there is hope, that you're not the only one who suffers from this and I, I have the privilege of helping people get better so I see it. So for me, I mean it's I know it like I know I'm breathing oxygen. For you, you, you might need to take a little leap of faith with me um, and, 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 and prove it to yourself. But I'd ask you to take that leap of faith uh, because we know what anxiety is. We know what causes it. We know the techniques that help. Um, I want to show them to you because they're not really widely available unless you go and uh, seek professional help. Um, if you haven't sought professional help, or maybe you have and um, it, it didn't quite work, or you're not asked for you to go ahead and um, take that leap of faith with me and, and go through some weeks of this program. We created the Intune video series to help you develop a lifestyle by using these techniques and by practicing things, um, small steps every week that turn into big steps. I cannot underscore to you how much these small changes just sort of uh, trigger the next changes. And before you know it, you, you I have some people who are sort of in the car, they go, you know what? I feel pretty good. I didn't re really realize how, um, how much better I'm getting. We want to help you get better. And I mean that in the technical sense. We want you to get better than you were before. And then we want you to for the rest of your life say I am getting better I'm better than I was in my practice and this is true in America too we have a lot of people who identify as Christians yet they really don't know how to use Christianity to um, uh, live the faith right and by that I mean they don't know how to uh, take the teachings of the Bible and uh, to use them and use in ways that help them to uh, feel close to God so part of what we want to do with this is bridge contemporary psychology with um, spirituality and um, for Christ followers Christianity was called wasn't called Christianity in its beginning it was called the way Christianity, in our view, is a path, and it's a very good path. We walk this path, and that helps us to feel safe, calm, give our lives a meaning, help us be less self-conscious, and um, feel purpose and value in each day.